what we have here is a 2016 Chevy Express conversion van by Explorer Van Company. This is a nine passenger, high top, two wheel drive version, six liter V8. Uh, I believe it has 58,000 or 57,000 and change in the odometer right now. Nice, nice vehicle in graphite color. Has uh, new black wheels. We put those Hilo wheels on there as well as brand new tires. Just been through service. Uh, this van's ready to go today. This has the chrome uh, front bumper with the fog lamps underneath. You do have the front step bumper to clean your windshield on the road if you need to. Uh, I don't see much damage across the front of the vehicle here as far as road rash and stuff goes. I hope you can hear my voice. The wind is kind of kicked up today. Uh, don't see... Okay, I got one small ding in the front of the hood right about here if you can see it. Uh, it's not hateful. There's a tiny little scratch as well on the finish. Other than that, I don't see any damage across the front end of this vehicle. Uh, look, I got brand new tires on it. Brand new Hilo wheels. Obviously no curb damage. The running boards look good. I don't see any cracks right now. The body looks very straight. Um, paint in good shape. Don't see any issues at all on the driver's side. Glass is all in good shape. Body looks good. Again. Getting around to the back, you got your backup sensors there, got your class three hitch and your seven pin RV connector. Uh, the back doors look really good. There's your uh, backup camera there. I got a couple dings right in this area here, if you can see them. Uh, very slight. Not much needed in reconditioning. It's all been pretty much done. This side looks really clean, too. A couple little... No. A little bit of dirt. Not really seeing a problem at all. Front here. That's in this fender too while I'm at it. Don't see any problems with the body. It looks really good actually. Nice gray and graphite inside. So you got the light gray and the darker gray. No rips, tears, or punctures. It smells like it's supposed to. It doesn't smell like it's ever been smoked in or used to transport animals. The center console with the cooler. Got the game hookup console, got USB charging, got storage, got your Blu-ray player under here. These center consoles do come out. They quick release each side to come out if you don't want it there. Center cup holder area. Uh, don't see any problem cracking. Don't have any issues in here. Been very well maintained. Dash looks good. Got the dark burl wood. 12 volt power, 5 volt power, 110 volt power. You have your OnStar, your airbag passenger on or off, traction control, 12 volt power. Let's get that sun out of your way. Your factory stereo, air conditioning controls, and of course you got your steering wheel controls. There's your odometer. Driver's seat, a little bit of crinkling in it, no real wear of any kind that I see. Inside the back, got the two tone door panels with blinds that are stain free. Seats look good. This is a nice van, very nice van. Very clean. And I gotta tell you, the way these been selling, it will not be here long. There's your center console. We have heated and lumbar arm controls on, of course, the driver's seat and passenger seat are 100% power. There's your flat screen with your front speakers and then your rear speakers for the surround sound. You have air conditioning and heat vents back there, more storage. Again, more storage, more storage. Uh, there's mood lighting back here. I'll turn that on now. It's at the switch bank up front here. As well as the rear air conditioning controls. And doing that activates the mood lighting here in the center console and then under the blind alliance areas. As well as lighted cup holders. Blinds are in really good shape. Back seats. Oh, looks 
like they're supposed to. More USB charging on each side. And then here's your rear sofa bed. Light a cup holders. See your compressor there for blowing up uh, floaty toys or your spare inflator. Rear cup holders lighted. You see the mood lighting here. Alright, I'll show you the operation of the sofa bed here in just a second. Got a little bit of, looks like bleach marks on the, on the carpet. I'm not sure what that's from. Uh, but it's stained to start. Colors taken out of it just a bit. Make sure these blinds are good. I'm going to stop it there because you would have to run those two seats up just a little bit to get it all the way flat. And there's a vacuum and your jack storage. There's also a full size spare underneath this vehicle. Alright. If you're interested further, get back with me with your thoughts, please. And uh, maybe we'll do business soon. Thank you much.